The creatures inside true Daleks were Dalek mutants. In the first appearance of the mutant form, TV, the Daleks, they were shown to have small hands that somewhat resembled the claws of a lizard, though the entire form was never shown. Later appearances of the mutants were very different, with the Seventh Doctor once describing them as, little green blobs. TV. Remembrance of the Daleks. According to one account, the creatures inside the Dalek casing were originally known as Dals. TV. The Ambush. Though, Dal, may have simply been another name for the Khaleds. Prose. The history of the Daleks. The living Dalek mutant possessed numerous tentacles, and either a central, single eye, or a normal right eye and a left eye so reduced in size as to be easily missed, overall resembling what Lucy Miller described as, if someone threw up a squid dinner. Audio. Blood of the Daleks. Despite their apparent lack of mobility, they were capable of defending themselves, as demonstrated when a Dalek attacked and killed a soldier. TV. Resurrection of the Daleks. Daleks also had some form of telekinesis. TV. Death to the Daleks. Prose. Twice upon a time, when referring to Dalek Khan, Davros, the very creator of the Dalek race, used male pronouns, implying the species was male. TV. Journey's End. However, the Ninth Doctor had used it to refer to the Metaltron, Dalek, implying the race was sexless. TV. Dalek. The Twelfth Doctor referred to Rusty by saying it, TV, twice upon a time, but, earlier in his life, had referred to the Daleks as Davos, boys. Missy referred to a supreme Dalek by using male pronouns. TV. The Witch is familiar. At least one member of the species, Dalek Sek, possessed a sac-like membrane large enough to engulf an adult human male in preparation for his final experiment. It was this membrane that he used to absorb Mr. Diagoras and transform into a human Dalek. TV. Daleks in Manhattan. All Daleks tended to think in the same way, meaning, conferences, between different Daleks were more akin to chorus of different Daleks agreeing with each other. Pros. Doctor Who and the Day of the Daleks. Some mutants had enhanced abilities. The mutant of a reconnaissance scout Dalek could possess and control other life forms, regenerate energy using ultraviolet light and was capable of surviving without a casing. TV. Resolution. Dalek mutants contained Dalek consciousness within even small organic remnants, or even a few pieces of DNA, from which a new Dalek could be grown. TV. Revolution of the Daleks. Heavily mutated members of other species, including humans, also occupied the casings on certain rare occasions. TV. Genesis of the Daleks. Revelation of the Daleks. The Parting of the Ways. Asylum of the Daleks. Main article. Dalek of Human Origin.